So I mentioned earlier that we would be looking at asset and negative asset accounts. So that's what we're up to now. Now the syllabus asks that you need to be able to explain the relationship between asset and negative asset accounts, specifically accounts receivable and provision for doubtful debts. So negative assets account accounts differ from the standard asset accounts because they have a credit balance. So we know our assets have a credit uh, have a de debit balance by nature. Negative asset accounts have a credit balance by nature. So asset accounts are offsite offset by their respective negative asset accounts to determine the asset's net balance. Now the provision for doubtful debts account is a negative asset account with a credit balance which reduces the accounts receivable figure listed in the statement of financial position and this ensures that the statement accurately documents the net realizable value of a business's accounts receivable. So like I said earlier it's unlikely that the business will receive the reimbursement for those debts and this is being reflected in the information to show that it's uh, not going to be realized so those those assets are not actually going to produce anything for the business so um, it's reducing that accounts receivable to reflect that.